All right, hey, I uh, want to say thank you, WikiLeaks, for exposing some of the corruption and basically bullshit that goes on inside the Hillary Rodham, Rodham Clinton campaign, the DNC, and all this crap that the media just doesn't seem to want to even report on. Um, I know you don't have anything to do with the videos that came out. We'll get to those in a second. But the, the email situation, you guys hacked into, I don't know who hacked into it. Quite frankly, I don't give a shit who fr freaking hacked into it. Um, it's a Russian, who cares? You know, the whole point of the matter is, is now the world's, and, and they're saying it's, they had a guy saying, I don't know what his name, some blackout glasses that was on Fox News. Uh, I was listening to them on Sirius Radio, I think it was yesterday. And he was saying, oh, Julian Assange is a criminal and he's a enemy of the United States of this country. Why is he hiding in a basement in the Ecuadorian embassy in London? How come he's not being brought to justice? Justice, you know, kiss my ass. You know what, if this was the other way around and these emails were coming out by, about Donald Trump, you freaking clowns would be all over it. You gotta stop trying to fool the American people. He said two, three months ago that he doesn't like Hillary Clinton. He doesn't like Donald Trump either, but he, doesn't, he really hates Hillary Clinton. That's the reason why he's doing this. She doesn't deserve to be president, for crying out loud. What, so we can have Bill back in the White House again? She says the other night in the debate, oh, I won't add a penny to the deficit. Yep. Okay, Bill, really? You're not going to add a penny to the deficit when you want more government spending? How much money are you going to take to people? Oh, we tax the wealthy. You know what? Let me explain something to you people that think that tax the wealthy is a bad thing, that not taxing the wealthy is a bad thing. Have you ever worked for anybody that's fucking poor? Have you? Have you worked for a company that's poor? I just want to know. Because the chances are the answer is no. Okay, so all the rich people that Hillary, Obama, and Bernie Sanders, and all these Democrats, all the people they want to tax are basically owners of companies. So in other words, they're taxing them on their own wealth and taxing them on their corporate tax too. So how much can you take from somebody? Okay? There's, it's not giving tax, Donald Trump's not giving tax breaks to the wealthy to keep money away from people like don't have money. That's not what it is. I don't understand what you people just don't understand it. A company's a company. It needs money to run company. The more money it has, the more people they can hire. Okay? The more people can be hired at a company. And I'm not even an economic expert for crying out loud. All right? So I see it. I work for a company where there's family owned. The guys were, were millionaires. Okay? And as the company grew, they were able to hire more people and pay more money and add health insurance, add 401k. They were able to do that stuff. But you wanna tax everybody, let's tax the rich. Let's be fucking Robin Hood, tax the rich, give it to people that don't wanna fucking work. It doesn't work that way. You want minimum wage raise? Minimum wage, number one, is for people first starting out a career in the, in the workforce. That's what it is. It's not made for people my age to go get minimum wage, for crying out loud. So, but, I just, people voting for Hillary Clinton, in my opinion, it's a bad choice. And all these emails are showing, they call them needy Hispanics. That wasn't put on mainstream media, was it? Okay? They're bombing on Christians and Catholics and evangelicals. If that was Donald Trump saying it about Muslims, they'd be hell to freaking pay. Okay, even their own campaign was going, is, is saying bad things. They call Bernie Sanders a doofus for crying out loud. You, that's what they really think of him. She's only got him on the campaign trail with him because she wants to pull you young people in. Oh, I can get Bernie out of with me to say we can give him free, free college. You know what, this free college shit ain't going to work. There's not enough money to pay for it. Okay, again, go back to the people who have money to pay for your college. Quite frankly, in my opinion, if you want to get a Pell Grant to help you to do something, that's fine and dandy, but nobody should be paying for your education through college. When you go to a, private, a public school, 
You pay from kindergarten to be a senior in high school, the taxpayers pay that money. Unless you go to a private school and you, the parents pay it on their own. Okay? I just want to thank Julian Assange for bringing all this to light to everybody. And, then, and there's more coming, I'm sure. Okay? There's more coming. So this election is not over by a long shot yet. So go ahead, Democrats. Be arrogant. Be act the way you want oh this is over she's pulling away no she's not okay she's not pulling away like you people think he did a pretty good job of the debate the other night and she tipped out tiptoed around stuff she's lying about it anyway now we could comes out that there's 12 million dollar offer for her to give a speech in fucking morocco for 12 million freaking dollars a country that oppresses women and and can't stand gay people they throw them off buildings they burn them in cages they throw them off buildings to kill them they stone women who cheat okay but she cares about women the abortion thing the other night oh if it's up to eight months we late term abortions but you're worried about a toddler getting a hold of a gun but you but you ha you're okay with doing that all right you got your own private stuff and then you public stuff you even said it yourself he even says it in the emails Hillary says this in private, she says this in public. She's hiding a lot of things from her voters. But again, I want to thank WikiLeaks, keep them coming. Um, we want to know, the public has the right to know who is going to be elected into office. All right, and I'm sure if he had stuff on Donald Trump, it'd be out too, but more, more of it's about Hillary and her campaign. They're pieces of shit. They don't care about the African-American community. All they care about is garnering your vote. The same thing with the Hispanics. It's all they care about. Once you elect them into office, they'll forget all about you. Look at all the, the major cities in America. They're all run by Democratic mayors. Detroit, Chicago, New York, Baltimore, Cleveland. They're all run by Democratic mayors. Okay? Do they care about you people? No. There should be law and order in this country. And I'm sure there's a lot of African Americans out there that are sick and tired of the garbage. It's time to vote Donald Trump. Forget about the Democrats. They don't care about you. Okay? Would you rather be out working on your own or you want to sit at home, get fat, have kids, do whatever? A lot of people don't want it that way. But vote Trump. Trump's the answer to fix this. So you take what you want out of this video, but keep your eyes open for more Weekly Week stuff because it's coming out. And it deserves to be out there. She deserves to be brought out in public to know what kind of fucking liar she is. Peace.